Carlos Diaz, C-A-R-L-O-S-D-I-A-Z, 4th A Battalion, h &S Company in Tampa, Florida. Uh, the operation that we're doing uh, in this evolution is called Strat Mobex. I'm the active maintenance chief for the track vehicles behind me. The Norwegians have been uh, fairly excellent in accommodating us and, and kind of uh, giving us direction on how they would like you know, the vehicles to be taken care of and, and moved out of the, uh, the caves that they're, they're currently in. Um, so it's just been a little bit different uh, kind of operating to their standard operating procedures, a little bit different than back home, but uh, they kind of given us a little bit of a learning curve and uh, we've been able to do so uh, fairly quickly. Strap Mobex is an exercise in order to work with our Norwegian counterparts in order to um, move vehicles uh, if needed be in an efficient manner. That way we can stage up should anything happen in the region. Strap Mobex is a, essentially a no-notice movement of when we can come out and uh, support the Norwegians in moving any tactical vehicles um, that are needed to be moved uh, with uh, very little to, to zero notice. Okay, um, Strat Mobex entails uh, us moving any tactical equipment uh, from point A to point B and uh, staging it and getting the gear prepped and uh, making sure everything's operational. One of the challenges is definitely the weather. Um, snow is not a really big hit from where I'm from, so it's, uh, it's getting a little bit of a taking, uh, getting used to but uh, the Norwegians have been there helping us, uh, supporting us uh, along the way. It's the first time that we're doing uh, a mission kind of like this, so it definitely um, helps, um, helps me realize. Can we start over on that one? <laughs> All right, can you state the question again? It's given us the tools to be able to plan for any future exercises like this. Now that we've gone through it, we can kind of see what needs to be done and how much personnel we actually need. So uh, if it were to happen again, we could do so uh, even smoother than we're doing it currently. I'd say the relationship between us and the Norwegians is uh, seamless. They're very welcoming, uh, very open to conversation. Um, there hasn't been one person that I haven't talked to that, that hasn't been uh, excited for us to be here. They're definitely as curious learning about us as we are about them. So it's been a good experience overall training with them. It definitely helps us by coming out here and again, working with the Norwegians and, and so we can kind of understand each other and how each country does, uh, you know, their standard operations. Sure. Yeah, no, I, I mean, Strat Mobex is definitely an exercise that I'm glad to be a part of. Um, it's definitely a, a great opportunity to come out to, to Norway and, and meet the Norwegian soldiers and, and get to interact with our allies and kind of uh, open our eyes to different sorts of operations that are going around in the world that the Marine Corps is involved in. Um, so it, it's actually been uh, a, a great trip so far, and uh, I'm glad that I come, uh, was able to come out here and, and train with the Norwegians.